Hey guys, Zane here with another quick one take review, and today I wanted to talk about the new CMAT album, If My Wife Knew, I'd Be Dead. If My Wife Knew, I'd Be Dead is the debut album from Irish singer-songwriter CMAT, who has had a string of assorted singles since early 2020 that have led up to her full-length LP, which is finally here in the form of this record. I will admit that I do find her casual mixture of indie pop and country-slash-folk very interesting, but I think she does the country-slash-folk portion much better. Honestly, the more pop-based numbers kind of make me feel I'm listening to pretty much any indie artist that's on the pop scene, really, in general. It, it just is completely unremarkable in that aspect. However, the Roots-related side of CMAT's music allows both her voice and her comedic but still heartbroken lyricism to shine much more, which makes for a very enjoyable portion of the record. Even still, there, there's no denying that that could use some fine-tuning as well. I mean, there's nothing particularly unique about her songwriting or her vocal delivery, and again, it, it does kind of sound like a lot of what's being put out besides her. There's nothing unique about her, generally speaking. But nonetheless, everything here is pleasant to the ear. And even if there is a portion of this album that I'm not really into, which is the more pop-oriented side, I think that C-Matt straight out of the gate has proven that she is a definite person to keep an eye on for future releases, and if she ends up doing a full country or a full folk or a full country rock kind of album in the future, don't be surprised if it's really fantastic. But as it stands, I can't really get into the more indie pop side of her music, and she definitely needs to refine her country and folk side as well, which is why I'm going to give this album 3.5 stars out of 5. I still found it very enjoyable, especially sonically, it was very smooth and hard to dislike listen, even in its worst moments, and overall I think it's a difficult album to not like, but it's also a difficult album to love, which is why I'm giving it 3.5 stars out of 5. And with that being said, that's the end of this quick review, and I will see you guys in the next one.